Welcome to UMA Libraries Library Search tutorial. So what is Library Search? Library Search is a federated search box found on the UMA Libraries homepage. It's a great way to search almost all of our resources at once. Books, journals, magazine articles, newspaper articles, and streaming videos can all be found here in Library Search. So to find Library Search, Navigate to the UMA Libraries homepage, which is where we are right now. You can get to our homepage directly from Brightspace or from the UMA Libraries portal. Once you've reached our homepage, scroll down to the library search box where you can enter keywords to search. Let's search the word autism. You can see our initial search yielded 153,000 articles. That's wonderful news, but also overwhelming. To narrow down our search, we need to click on limiters on the left-hand side. But first, let's sign in to ensure we're getting all possible options. Here, you wanna enter your main.edu account, which will log us in through UMA to ensure that we have access to everything. As I mentioned on the left, our limiters, let's reduce our results by ensuring everything is available immediately online. My professor does want me to include peer reviewed journals, so I'm gonna search by that. And let's include articles only rather than books. Now let's see what happens when we apply these filters. So it reduced our results to 104,000, still a lot. We can reduce that further by adding more keywords or continuing to use the limiters on the side. Let's add another keyword and do girls. So you can see that brought us down to 3,000. That's a much more manageable number of resources. So let's scroll through and see what we have for results. Now I can see already that I'm interested in this first article. We can see here's the title of the article, the authors, the journal it was published in, as well as the journal publication information. It tells us it's available online, which we should know that should be a possibility since we checked available online initially. Some other things to pay attention to are these uh, icons right here. The permalink, will uh, you can save that and that will get you directly back to this article. You can also email the article to yourself uh, and what's helpful about that, and I'll show this to you, is if we click that, you enter your email address and send. It also includes the citation, um, which is very helpful. And so that will all be in an email message to yourself. If you click on citation, you can also grab the MLA or APA citation directly from here um, and copy and paste that and put that into your references or works cited page. So let's click on this article. You can see it tells us all of these databases which have the article in it. And this is where we can find that. So if we click into this, this often comes up. Um, and so you'll want to choose which campus you belong to. And in this case, we'll do the University of Maine at Augusta. And here is the PDF of the article. Now from here, we could also do the same thing and come over here on the right hand side and either print the article, email it to ourselves, find the citation. You can do it multiple ways. Um, it's often easier to do it directly from library search, but the PDF is also nice because it, it's an identical copy of what was actually published in the journal. So that's a quick overview of our library search tool.